do that. Gabby did well. Niguez off the outside of the boot. Green's hand! Atletico Madrid have that goal now. So what do you know about this? Griezmann for Atletico. They lead 1-0. And that's a collection of a wonderful year. Yep, 28. What is going on everybody and welcome back to a brand new team of the season player review and today we are going to be looking at the 95 rated French striker from Atletico Madrid Antoine Griezmann. If you do enjoy this player review make sure to leave a big thumbs up on it as always that is massively appreciated and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you are new around here but um, without any further ado let's get stuck into one of the most anticipated team of the season cards of this year on FIFA in my opinion. Antoine Griezmann, he stands at 5 foot 9 inches tall, he's got 4 star skill moves and a 3 star weak foot with high medium work rates. His price spans are between 130k and 2.5 million and as I record this is currently going for around 600 odd k but obviously at the moment prices are fluctuating quite a lot depending on uh, what packs are out and at what time you are searching. Uh, the in games and base card stats for this card like I've already mentioned he is a 95 which puts him on the same level as Benzema who I did a play review on yesterday. Uh, yeah, yesterday it was. And uh, yeah, that's pretty interesting. I'd say his base card stats are a little bit better than Benzema's. You're looking at 95 pace, 96 dribbling, 97 shooting, 93 passing, 85 physical, and 44 defending. And in game wise, we have got our second 99 stat lockout. He has got 99 finishing, 99 positioning, 99 agility, 99 volleys, and 99 heading. And he had a couple of other 99s as well. He had more outside of the top five. And uh, stats, uh, sorry, uh, traits and specialities wise, as so many of these teams in the season players seem to have, he has quite a few. He's got speed dribbler, speedster, aerial threat, which is something you don't expect with Antoine Griezmann. He's also got dribbler, distance shooter, crosser, acrobat, clinical finisher, complete forward, and poacher as well. Uh, looking at the team that we used him in, uh, you can see that it's obviously a flat out Liga BBVA team, the likes of Silva, Inaki Williams in there. And uh, in the five games that we played, with this Antoine Griezmann card, he went ahead and got nine goals and zero assists. But um, again, you might be thinking that's not the greatest return, but it's got to be said, out of the five games that I played, three people rage quit, two of them within 10 minutes, and one of them before the 20th minute. So he could have had so many more. I'm convinced that he would have gone on to get around sort of 12, 13 goals, at least if those people hadn't been rage quitting. But um, as we start to get into some of the game clips of Antoine Griezmann's team in the season card in action now, I'm just going to say straight away, Heads and shoulders above team of the season, Kareem Benzema. I did the review on him yesterday, like, like I've already mentioned, and um, I was a little bit critical of him. I said his finishing wasn't that great. A few people have said in the comments they've had the same situation. A couple of people have disagreed. But um, the reason this card is more than Benzema, A, it is just better in-game. B, it's statistically better. It is just a much better card. The only negative to Antoine Griezmann's team of the season card for me was strength, which wasn't particularly bad. That was me being a little bit nitpicky. You can see him holding off a defender in that goal there, actually. But yeah, that was a little bit nitpicky off me. But his strength was the weakest part of his game. But when it comes out to the, the when it comes down sorry, to the things that you want from a striker, he feels absolutely rapid. His dribbling is insane. His movement is also absolutely amazing. He's always making the runs that you want the striker to be making. Back to goal again, absolutely fantastic. He can turn, he can turn so so well. His positioning is awesome and most importantly his finishing is on another level his finishing is absolutely superb lads one on one left foot he's he just he's always going to do the job right foot wasn't too bad considering he's only got a three star weak foot but it wasn't the best i didn't put that in a negative but it's sort of on the brink i didn't think it was terrible but it wasn't amazing either but um overall we're going to be giving antoine griezmann's team of the season card a 9.5 out of 10. I didn't think it was quite up there with team of the season Jonas, which is still the best striker card I've personally used this year, but it wipes the floor with Benzema's, and I do think it's an exceptionally good card, and I'd highly recommend you go out there and give it a go. Like I've already said, fantastic stuff for, for Mo Griezmann is his pace, his dribbling, his shooting, his movement, his positioning, everything you could possibly want from a striker, and he's just so fun to use. But um, that wraps up this player review, lads. Hope you all did enjoy it. Leave a thumbs up on it, like I've already mentioned, if you did, and I'll speak to you all in tomorrow's video, lads. Ninja out. Yo, his niche plays with big games and player reviews are getting insane. He entertains while he elevates his video quality resonates on career mode. He got lots of vids uploading off and he's rocking it. He's got the confidence in all his commentaries. Videos range, they often vary. Got need for speed and a road to glory. Just watching vids and you know the story. The content is underrated. I'm understating, so don't ignore the like and subscribe button to support the channel that keeps running. It takes one second, like it's free. It costs nothing. Peace.